Now the Senate is expected to be recalled for a special sitting to consider the motion seeking to legally establish the National Dialogue Committee after the National Assembly gave it a nod Thursday last week. This was revealed after the committee's third meeting where its members reviewed the progress that had been made since the formation of the 10-member team, with the members concerned that politicians were making utterances casting doubt on the ability of the National Dialogue Committee, its leadership urging Kenyans to ignore the doubting Thomases. While the committee will hold its fourth meeting Friday, the technical committee will continue to sit up until Thursday as they firm up the framing of issues. The two technical teams presenting both sides in the dialogue have continued to engage very, very constructively, and especially on the twin issues of the framework agreement and the framing of issues. We are all here uh, from both coalitions engaging in good faith. We want to confirm to the country that Kenyans of all walks of life have their views and their opinions, which we appreciate and we uh, recognize their rights to the freedom of expression. But whatever other Kenyans say out there will not in any way determine the discourse of the engagements in this room. And uh, we will work ignoring all the other noise uh, that will come from other quarters out there.